Assalamu alaikum, my dear students of class 3. How are you? Hope all of you are well by the blessing of Almighty Allah. Welcome to our online platform NIEVS Home School. This is Muhammad Abul Kalam, Assistant Teacher of National Ideal English Version School. Dear learners, today I am going to conduct an English literature class for the students of class 3. Let's see our today's topic. It is paragraphs 1 and 2. I am telling our today's topic is paragraphs 1 and 2. Dear learners, look here. This is our lecture number 8 and homework number 6 on our half yearly syllabus. Dear students, so let's start our class with looking at the board. So look, uh, I have written here homework, a farmer and then below one is gardening. So, our two paragraphs, first one is a farmer and another one is a gardening. Dear learners, let's start with the first one, it is a farmer. So, look, I think you can see it properly, it is a farmer. A farmer is a person whose main occupation or main works is to grow crops. Okay, look at the first sentence here, we have got the definition and okay, what is a farmer? Okay, who is a farmer? It is seen. A farmer is a person whose main occupation is to grow crops. He grows many crops like paddy, jute, wheat, sugarcane, etc. That means, what does he grow? So, look here. He grows many crops like paddy, jute, wheat, sugarcane, etc. He usually does not own land. So, look here. He usually does not own land. That means, he usually doesn't have his own land or property. A farmer is very hard working person. He wakes up before sunrise. He works the whole day. At midday, he takes a short break for lunch. He continues to work in sun and rain. He stops when the sun sets. He does a very important job for the us or for us. So look here, dear students, we have learned here the paragraph about a farmer. I am telling you again and your duty is to do this homework, a farmer and you will memorize these two paragraphs. First one is a farmer. I am telling you again, a farmer is a person whose main occupation is to grow crops. He grows many crops like paddy, jute, wheat, sugarcane, etc. He usually does not own land. A farmer is very hard working. He wakes up before sunrise. He works the whole day. At midday, he takes a short break for lunch. He continues to work in sun and rain. He stops when the sun sets. He does a very important job for us. Yes, that means number one, a farmer is done. Now look another one, it is gardening. Look at the title, it is gardening. Gardening is one kind of hobby. So look here, laser time activity is gardening. It gives us pleasure and entertainment. Look at the word. It gives us, what does it give? Or what does gardening give us? It gives us pleasure and entertainment. My hobby is gardening. My garden is near our house. I have protected it with fence so that animals cannot do any harm to my garden. There are different kinds of flowers in it. For example, rose, tube rose, marigold, sunflower, etc. The flowers make my garden wonderful. We can make garland for our festival and decorate our house on occasion with these flowers. Next, in fact, my garden is a great source of pleasure and recreation to me. Dear learners, we have finished our reading, second paragraph, it is gardening. I am telling you again, so that all of my students can clearly understand. Gardening is one kind of hobby. It gives us pleasure and entertainment. My hobby is gardening. My garden is near our house. I have protected it with fence so that animals cannot do any harm to my garden. There are different kinds of flowers in it. For example, rose, tube rose, marigold, 
sunflower etc the flowers make my garden wonderful we can make garland for our festival and decorate our house on occasions with this flower in fact my garden is a great source of pleasure and recreation to me dear learners look i am telling you again so look uh, a farmer this paragraph will be your homework and this is your sixth number homework i am telling you again whenever you will start writing your homework don't forget to write lecture number 8 then homework number 6 then the title of the paragraph a farmer and you must underline the title of the paragraph it is a farmer this is your homework dear learners i hope that you have understood the two paragraphs which we have read first one is a farmer and which is your homework this is your six number homework and another one is gardening dear learners try to memorize these two paragraphs and do your homework a gardening finally see you again inshallah assalamu alaikum